Hi guys, it's Magaz here. I'm the UK ICS captain for 2017 and I'm here with ICS at the IWA show 2017 in Nuremberg. So today I'm going to be talking to you about some of the new products we've got on the market and why you should probably have a look at them. This is the ICS BLE or Black Leopard Eye. Extreme ambidextrous enhanced pistol which is an updated version of the BLE Alpha. As with the BLE Alpha, it is a gas blowback system that runs on green gas. Using the standard green gas magazine, the slide is metal, has the slide release on both the right and left side of the frame, so it's ambidextrous. As you can see just there. You can also power stroke it if you're that way inclined. The, what is a, a great feature on this pistol is for left-handed shooters, the magazine release works from both the right and left hand side of the frame so if you do shoot this way you can release the magazine with your left hand so it is a truly ambidextrous design it has a two-stage trigger similar to that of an M&P or a Glock where it won't actually pull unless you engage the full trigger and it does feature a safety switch on the trigger which when you engage the trigger will not pull no matter what but that's more for kind of storage because a little bit temperamental to get to but that two-stage trigger really does work for the safety aspects of the gun. Externally, very similar to the original Black Leopard Eye, it has a 20mm accessory rail up front so you can put your flashlights or vertical foregrips or silly little grenade launchers on there if you really want to. And to the rear, the back strap is interchangeable, you can switch it out, it's a little bit stiff. You see it comes as standard with both the flat and the curved grip so large hands might want to go for the curved grip or people with small girly hands like me might want to go for the flat one that is the BLE XAE you can expect to see this one in your local ICS dealers sometime around April 2017 so the next thing we're going to take a look at is the ICS MARS or MARS which is the modern assault rifle system it's just been announced this year at IWA 2017 and we have four models of it in two different colorways to show you guys now. So we'll start down here at the bottom. We have the SBR version or short barreled rifle. Ideal for your CQB player. We move up, we have the DMR or designated marksman rifle which comes with a new ICS sniper stock which is fully adjustable for cheek weld and length of your arms. Above that we have the carbine version which is just your average length skirmish rifle and at the top we have the Komodo. Now the reason this rifle is called the Komodo is if we take a look at the carbine version here. The rail at the front has this sort of Komodo dragon looking mouth. If you take a look at a Komodo dragon yawning or trying to eat some flies you'll see why it's called the Komodo. So let's take a rundown of the actual rifle platform. Take the magazine out. So again, as with the XAE pistol, this is a completely ambidextrous design. It has all the features that you've come to love and expect from an ICS rifle, that split gearbox design, the fantastic hop up back there, and just absolute incredible performance out of the box. But now coupled with ambidextrous fire selector, as you can see on here, fully right and left ambidextrous. Lock this up a second. The magazine release is improved in design by making it slightly bigger and easier to access so if you've got a smaller finger you can actually get to that no worries you switch over to the other side you can see the magazine release is also ambidextrous which is great up front we have a brand new designed handrail it's super lightweight super sturdy and it is monolithic with the upper receiver the front part of it is all key mod ready so you can move these rails about to where you like it does come with backup iron size already installed in case you don't have a an optic of choice. And we'll pop this magazine back in here as usual. 300 round high capacity magazine with a viewing window so you can see how many rounds you've got left. It's got a fully adjustable stock as you would expect from any AR platform. But if we take a look over here at the the DMR version which is very similar but like I mentioned earlier has 
the enhanced sniper stock, which is fantastic if you want a modular stock platform. If you're using a, a high mounted optic, you can adjust the height of the cheek weld and the length of the stock for those people with longer arms and bigger guns than me. <coughs> Pop that back. The last one we've got here is the Komodo. This is probably going to be the most popular one due to that interesting design up front and the 416 style stock which again is multiple positions and it has a massive storage capacity for batteries in the rear. You can fit three LiPo batteries in there and just switch the plugs over as they run dry, which is fantastic for those longer, say, milsim operations or things like that. So like I mentioned, we do offer these in alternate color styles. This is two-tone with the ICS flat darker style metallic front and the pistol grip and stock and the magazine is also in that flat dark earth sort of colour. Everything internally and externally aside from the colour is identical to the standard black Komodo. It's just this one looks a little bit cooler. 